that if the West tried forcibly to prevent the East Germans from carrying out the new duties that he planned to give them, the Soviet Union would fight to defend East German, its East German ally. Well, as ultimatums usually do, this one had a timetable. He gave us six months to sign a peace treaty with East Germany and to agree to turn West Berlin into a demilitarized, quote unquote, free city, as he called it. Well, by issuing this threat, Khrushchev made, I would argue, a major mistake. In fact, several of them, and let me list them. First of all, he didn't really think through the consequences that might follow his ultimatum, issuing of his ultimatum. Secondly, he did not consult, or at least did not consult fully, with his own colleagues and advisors, uh, although he talked to them a little bit, but he, when, when he did, they knew what he had wanted to do because he had already told them. Number three, he did not have a clear plan of action. Number four, he underestimated the obstacles in his path, particularly the resistance to what he was proposing on the part of West, Chancellor, West German Chancellor Adenauer and French President de Gaulle. And five, he did not have a fallback plan if and when, as happened, the West did not accept his proposal.